How's it going everyone? Today I'll be presenting our final project for the Estonian English Processing class. We have implemented an emotion recognition web application built on top of the machine learning functionalities provided by JavaScript library called MF5, which in turn is based on a well-known machine learning library called TensorFlow.js. This project was inspired by a Google AI experiment called Teachable Machine, and you can learn more about that at teachablemachine.wordgoogle.com. First, let's start with a demo. Thanks to the power of TensorFlow.js and MF5, our code runs directly in the browser in JavaScript, without the need for any external servers. Right off the bat, the application shows you the webcam input, it also highlights your face and waits for further instructions. Below are a number of buttons for each emotion. When you click on one emotion, you're basically providing a current image of your face as a training data labeled as whatever the button emotion you have clicked. The number of training samples provided by the, the number of training samples provided to the machine learning algorithm is shown between parentheses inside of each emotion. After providing the app with multiple training images, it's now ready for training. This is done simply by clicking on the train button and then start the training process. When the progress bar says it's finished, this means that the app is ready to predict your user's emotion. It may seem like magic given the fact that our dataset hasn't been huge, however, this is possible as we're using a pre-trained convolutional neural network model called MobileNet. MobileNet provides a CNN that is trained thoroughly on different sets of images. This means that its convolutional layers serve for great feature extractor, which in turn means that we're only going to need to train the dense layers in the neural network making the training process go much faster. This technique is called transfer learning and we go more thoroughly into that in our report and our code repository.